Alrighty everybody, so in today's video we're going to be doing something a little bit different and that's going to be fabricating up a attachment for the skid steer. So here's what I've got in mind. I have this box blade for the tractor and I really need a box blade for the skid steer. Reason being is I want to be able to laser grade things um, and I feel like with the skid steer, I'll have, skid steer I'll have a little more control than with the tractor. Um, I just fabricated up a pole for the laser grader and I also... Um, I just bought the Topcon, uh, it's like the LSB110W, whatever that is. Um, it basically makes it to where um, I can have a laser receiver pull and laser receiver on, on an attachment and check the grade while I'm moving. Um, it'll also integrate into the automatic grade control system. So uh, eventually we, we can run automatic grade control on our machines, but basically I want to get this box blade ready for, for grading. And we have a project coming up on Monday, it's currently Friday, um, where we're, we're gonna need this. So my plan is to take these two by four pieces of steel tubing, bolt one down here and then one up here, and then take this 3 8 inch piece of steel plate and fabricate up a mount for the, for the Bobcat so the Bobcat quick attach can hook in there and then I can use this for that. So let's get started.
done for now i will have to paint that up so it don't completely rust i'll probably end up doing that here pretty soon whenever i find some time though i'm trying to get out of the wind right now but it works great i did have to patch up weld right there and weld over there um this one cracked those are the ones you used the stuck welder on and that stick welder is just it's like a hobby welder it's not good at all um, but everything else is good i'm gonna make some points for that i haven't noticed I mean, it, it didn't suck, suck it in at all. I mean, I don't think it's really gonna be a problem, but I just be safe than sorry, um, since it is a heavy piece of equipment. It is 12,000 or 9,000 pounds behind it. You know, it could break something pretty easily. Uh, but all the other welds on the plate work and everything works great. Um, this works fantastic. I, those things are perfect. And the rebar is actually working pretty good, but that's it for now.